Do not trust this girl around technical stuff. Hi guys. So. Grayson here. So. Grayson here. Right. What's your name? Sancho. Yeah. Yeah. That's my name. He Don't worry about it. name. Ha 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 ha. I did not. Yeah, you did. You're the one that forgets your name. I didn't forget my name. And breaks anything that has no, tech. No. Anything with no, circuits, no, you no, break. No. You. No. Anyway. No. I haven't broken my amp or my electric guitar. <laughs> yeah. Hmm. <laughs> anyway. What we doing today? Oh yeah, I know. Mm -hmm. We's listening to a song that she says doesn't exist. No, it doesn't. Hailstorm sang it first. Yeah, when did Hailstorm come out? I don't know. Like, after 2000? Probably. Right. So in 1980s, no. 20 years before Miss, Liz before Miss Lizzie Hale was probably a sparkle in her daddy's eye. Death Leopard sang no. Love Bites. No. <laughs> Hailstorm did it first. To prove my point, here's Love Bites by Death Leopard. <laughs> Oh, I like your kisses. Mm mm mm. Don't play the damn video. I don't know why did she ask me today, ain't I? It's like anything like he has Trump sang her own version of it. So it's her song. Stole the title though. Baby. Yeah, you lost your baby before. You did you? Yeah. So you knew and you still argue with me. Don't. Okay, 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 okay. Listen, listen, listen. Maybe I didn't know what the song was called. It's pretty obvious if you play it. Just listen. Here it comes, here it comes. Love bites! <laughs> now keep playing it. Uh, I didn't know what it was called. It's called Love Bites! <laughs> She looks like a girl. Well, so all rock scary. stars in the 80s look like girls. Yeah. We should see John Bon Jovi in the 80s. Woo! She's a pretty girl. No, no, no. She looks like a girl, so that means that he's left him, which means he left him right first. So you're saying all girls are hailstorm? No. So Emily Autumn is hailstorm? No, she's not. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Amanda Palmer, hailstorm? No. <laughs> Samantha Fox? Say, since she did a hailstorm song, since she did a hailstorm song, that means that she is hailstorm. Your logic is impeccably wrong. <laughs> impeccably wrong. Play, 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 play. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, look, look, it's his hailstorm, see? Alright, alright, play it. As long as you agree with me that hailstorm say love bites. Sure, why not? After Death right? Leopard did. Mm -hmm. Yeah, play the song. So your embarrassment can continue. Also, yeah, all 
these rock stars look like chicks. Yeah, he did kill some songs for like Talk about representation for the female. Were there any 80s rock stars on sci-fi? Oh yeah, most sci-fi movies in the 80s had a music video break. It's like, we're going to stop the movie right here and do a music video. People say that there is no, no sci-fi women. But there are. Have Lucy you Wallace. Seen? Have you Game seen Death Leopard? And he was on the sci-fi channel, was it he? I mean, if you look at the 80s rock bands, females dominated in the 80s. Guys used more hairspray than women. Twisted mm -hmm. Sister even sang a song about it. Yep. We wanna be women. Yeah, we wanna be women. We don't wanna be men anymore. Am I in the screen? Despite all the guys looking like girls, I mean, I'm surprised that drag queens aren't more accepted among the mainstream culture. Because honestly, in the 80s, every rock band was a drag queen. Yeah. 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 All right, I'll wait while you type. You go right ahead. By the way, that, that song was exceptional. It was, isn't it? I was creative. That's awesome. For a bunch of drag queens. <laughs> More Aquanet was used backstage at a rock concert in the 80s than was used in all of Lithuania during the 80s. Just one rock concert. Please, donate today to yes, give our Lithuanian brothers and sisters go. some hair or spray. Here we go. Oh, dry and brittle hair. Oh, what commercial! That proves practice. your point so well. Use the last and and just check in the description. When did this song come out? For 24 hour lasting moisture. Nexus therapy and mattress. 2012. Let's see. That is like 30 years after. She, she totally did hear strange. Yeah, in 2012, play the song. Now, in 2012, she came out with this song, and, and Death Leopard Hysteria came out in like 86, so like um, 26 years later. We're totally listening to two songs in this video. Right on. You forget about her. And who cares? If you don't like it, you can stop watching. Yep, just click away. I dare you. I double dare you. So do I love You can totally cover this song. See? See? You know what you should do? You should learn to play both. You should learn to play both songs, Love Bites, and then do a duet. Like, do, do like a medley of the two songs. Put them together. Oh, 
don't forget about her So I can't leave her heart out Love us is all the way It's all the way Love us is all the way I must say, she is a much more attractive uh, woman than um, they, they kind of look like men dressed up as women. Uh, so first of all, she, she, it's a girl, it's a girl need a band that wears her best. So. Right, I'm just saying she looks, she, she's a more attractive woman than the uh, lead singer of Death Leopard. Probably doesn't use as much Aquanet either. So this is a hamster inside her fur. We just listened to it, so I'm not sure about that. She read it. 26, after, 26 years after Death Leopard came up with theirs. But you still sung it. So they both sung it. But it wasn't a cover. It was her own original love fight. So, she uh -huh. had love fight too. But Death Leopard was first. Yeah. And their drummer only got one arm. Imagine playing drums with just one arm. I can't even play drums. Wait, it would be kind of hard to do it on a pretty 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 Unless he got a mechanic arm. Nah, he set it up so that he could do that one, two, three, four thing with his feet. He built his own custom made drum kit because he wanted to play drums so bad that losing his arm in an automobile accident wasn't going to stop him. See? That's dedication. That is Hamster Love Bites. Right. Now tell me who wrote Almost this. Almost 30 years after Death Leopard Love Bites. Yes, so tell me. Yes, exactly. They yes. Both, yes, yes. They both wrote Love Bites, but in their different personas. So you should learn both songs on guitar and then like do a medley. Mash them together. Do a mashup. Well, maybe. So what do you think of Death Leopard? Maybe you could sing... Um, you, it could be like a battle between them, and you could play guitar and sing um, Death um, Leopards, and then also girl, and play Hamster. Girl, how am I going to play guitar? How about my dad? I don't got no opposable thumbs. Never mind, that video's not coming out.